Welcome back. While well, giving birth can be quite the experience, but for a West Monroe family, it was a family experience in a lot of ways. Yeah, Tammy Arinder has tonight's Two Cars New Winners about St. Francis. Three sisters, triplets, Kristen, Robin, and Whitney. Robin and Whitney are holding babies who were born just hours apart. Robin's delivery began at one hospital, and when things turned critical, she was moved to St. Francis. I was scared. I was scared. They, they told me it was life or death for both of us. Day, my blood pressure was high. I ended up having them that evening. And he was born at 30 weeks, 2 pounds, 12 ounces, and um, he stayed in the NICU for 37 days. It was nearly a week before Robin could even kiss her baby boy because she had a fever blister. But the staff in the NICU at St. Francis made sure she and husband Garrett could bond with the baby. The NICU nurses are absolutely amazing. They are. Now, across the hall on April 19th was her sister, Whitney. And they put us across the room. The nurses let her bring her baby over and just us go back and forth. I mean, it was, it was amazing. Eileen Greer, who happens to be a twin herself, born at St. Francis, is mom to Robin and Whitney. She described those hours at the hospital where her daughters were giving birth. It was just major chaos. But I knew it was in God's hands, and uh, he was with us, you know, with the girl. So I was confident that everything was going to be good. Moms and babies are doing fine now. All agree their harrowing experience was made better by the doctors and nurses who tended to them. My next children I want at St. Francis. Right. In West Monroe, I'm Tammy Orinder for KNOE 8 News. We are, of course, joining St. Francis for their Two Cars, Two Winners campaign to help the NICU there and the pediatric unit. You can buy a raffle ticket for a Nissan Titan or a Toyota 4Runner at the locations you see at the bottom of your screen there. We, of course, have the information on our website.